Um, Red Dead Redemption Two, it's happening. Still not. It's still not Destiny though. <laughs> no, you, but shut up. Anyway, up. Red Dead Redemption Two is definitely coming out, and apparently Scuttlebutt has it. Uh, fall of 2016. Uh, what do you guys think, uh, Josh? You take it away. <laughs> um, I have never played the the series to be honest. I mean, I did, I, I did bought it. I should probably check try it out. <laughs> you bought it, and never played it. Wait, Damn. wait, wait! I am one of Dude, those type one. of gamers. That's cool. I bought, hey, hey! I, I totally. I... Oh, sorry, oh, Josh. Ahead. Oh, I was saying that, uh, that I buy games and I, I say I, I want to play them, I, but I just haven't got it around to play them yet. I mean, I will eventually. <laughs> well, I'd say like 99% of the games I've ever bought, I've never beaten, because I'm like the type of gamer who doesn't see beating the game as like the goal. So like I'll buy a game and I'll play it for like a couple hours and then I'll shelf it and probably never pick it up again unless it's very, very good. Oh, I feel guilty about it. I, I have tons mm. of games I need to play and Opposite. beat. I have tons of games I need to play and beat, but but especially with doing these videos on YouTube, I've actually played the games less. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. Like Fallout 4, I've been wanting to really get into it, but it's just like, oh, but I need to play Punch Out, or I need to play this game. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we'll do we'll do we'll do a Let's Play on Fallout 4 or something soon. Yeah. Uh, I'll just like Sky. I'll just like. Uh, Twitch you in and we'll play. I'm like a big. I'm really bad at it. Yeah. <laughs> I get really, I get really frustrated with Fallout 4 because I'm like, oh, which way do I go? Uh, it's too much to do. I, I'm just gonna sit well, here and build up my base and build ladders and shit. That's what I did when I played Fallout 4. I literally built ladders on my base for like three hours. <laughs> well, I, I was gonna say, uh, back back on the subject though. Red Dead though. Red Dead Redemption, excellent game. Highly suggested. Did Josh, did you get it digitally or do you have the physical copy? I got the physical copy. Okay. I tried my best to get physical copies. <laughs> okay, I was going to say, because right now, you can get, uh, if you bought it digitally, you can download it because it's backwards compatible right now uh, on, uh, nice. on Xbox One. If you have it digitally. If you have the physical <laughs> copy, you can't. Which I have, the, uh, I'm like you, I have the physical copy. So uh, <laughs> That's fucked up. Because they haven't, they haven't officially announced it yet. It's not official. Oh. But since you own so it they digitally. They have to probably put it in one of their, their lists or whatever. Yeah, yeah, they haven't done it officially yet. So that's why it hasn't popped up yet. Yeah, it's but, like a, um, there was a Jesus little con. Fuck. Like right now, they've actually posted usernames where you can click on that user or go to that user on your Xbox One and they, uh, it, if you look at their list of games, it'll show Red Dead Redemption and you can click on it and you can download it. So it's not official. It's not official, but it is possible to download the game right Man, now on out. your Xbox One. Um, uh, I <laughs> can't wait. Maybe they fix the fucking multiplayer. Yeah, maybe. No, I don't think they will because they got they have GTA Five to take care of right now. So, do you really think they're gonna go? Oh, let's make sure the Red Dead Redemption servers are good. They gotta make sure GTA Five's servers are are good. They've which, got, by like, the way, one Red Dead server somewhere in the closet. Which, by the way, if you guys love GTA Five, check out Static J's uh, montage video. <laughs> it's really good, actually. I loved it. Death Clock. I love Death Clock. So. By the way, Thank is you. that is that um I, I haven't played much of the GTA five multiplayer. Do you get to fully customize like your outfit and everything uh, in the game? Because I noticed you had like a cool little gear on your character, like the mask and everything. Uh more in a in a way, yeah. You can. I have to go around uh different sh shops in different locations for like the mask and the uh the bulletproof vests and, and things like that. It's it's uh it's a lot to do. <laughs> you made me want to get. I have it on my 360, but I want to get it on my Xbox One now, uh because it looks yeah. really good yeah, on I, I the Xbox that... One. <laughs> yeah, because the the new the new generations they uh well system or you play if whether you play it on PC or the Xbox One or PS4, it's like more, a lot more to do with their options and stuff. 
So if, like more in a way, I guess you can say it's more freedom to do. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. I probably would have played it more if I could get past the car tutorial. <laughs> I figure it's pretty important to know how to drive a car in that game. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we're not, Josh, we're, yeah. we're not good yeah. at driving, especially me. If you're ever in Halo with me, never let me drive the Warthog. I'm terrible. <laughs> well, I'm, you not, I'm said not good that at it. You jackass. <laughs> so, <laughs> I, I'm terrible at it. Anyway, we're, we're getting a little off subject here. Red Dead Redemption. It's coming out apparently fall 2016. Finally. I will add, yeah, finally. Well, Grand Theft Auto, they also said this in the article, which I will link in the description below, but they say that they want to take their time with their franchises. They don't want to become a yearly thing. They want to take time with their games. And um, what was I going to say? I was going to say, do any of you who've played the story, I hate to spoil it, spoiler warning, but do you think you will take control of of the son of the main character or do you think they're going to do a grand no. theft or do you think they're going to do a grand theft auto and just new location new characters new everything i think it's new location i think they're going to do a grand theft auto because it's the perfect world to do it because um it's a harsh environment <laughs> western times you know you can basically do anything you want to in that world so i think it's uh I think they're, they're going to create new characters and whatnot. They did it with 1 and 2, and I think they're going to... Uh, Red Dead Revolver, and then Red Dead Redemption, Dead they did it with those, and then they're going to do it with this one. Um, it's going to be called Red Dead Reconnaissance, and it's going to be in the future, and we'll have jetpacks. No, um, no but, but ser seriously, um, Rockstar... Nice. Rock Rockstar is a... If you play Rockstar's games, they're famous. You can tell they really love movies. Like with the Grand Theft Auto series, they took a lot of inspiration from like Godfather and movies like that. Do you think Red Dead Redemption 2 might be taking some inspiration from, say, Hateful Eight or uh, The Revenant in this future title? No. Nah. No? Not from Hateful Eight. The timeline nah. wouldn't work. They'd already be coding it long before Hateful Eight came out. If it's coming out in 2016. No, if anything, no, you, they would you, be referencing guys, older movies such guys, as Clint guys, Eastwood movies. Yeah, yeah, Clint Eastwood movies. But guys, you forget we live in the age of DLC. Really, what we call it? So. <laughs> 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 no, what were you going to say, Josh? <clears throat> I was like, when there was one Western film that came out, I think it was uh, True Grit. I think it was like 2010. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, it was yeah. a re... Uh, that was... Well, that was originally a uh, that was a reboot of uh, oh, yeah. Grit, which was a John Wayne movie. That's yeah. true. <laughs> Duke. Um, I, I'm looking forward that was done to by it. The Coen Brothers. This is one the of the second one. The, the, the remake. I was gonna say this is one of the games that I'm looking forward to. Um, now I'm going to have the question of do I get it on PS4 or Xbox? Probably Xbox One because I play with more people on Xbox One, so my multi-plat system's going, going to be the Xbox One. But still, I'm looking forward to this game. Uh, are any of you guys interested in it at all? Probably. Hell yes, uh, and so, hell yes. As soon as I played as a uh, Red Dead Redemption that's, that's, game... That's because of without that. request. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's, he, he'll buy it and put it on a I shelf and never play it. it. Yeah. <laughs> or be like me, buy it and be like, oh, I'm going to play five it. minutes. <laughs> he'll frame it new in the cellophane. Get to my collection. <laughs> here's, here's the word. I, I'm right there with you, Josh, because I'll, I'll buy it and be like, oh, man, I'm playing five minutes of it, but i got to get to this review, so I'll get back to you later, <laughs> and I never play it again. <laughs> he'll make me and Donovan buy it, and we'll like get all into it, and he'll be interested for five yeah. seconds in the game. Yeah, I'm. I am guilty That's, of that. That is true. <laughs> I am guilty. He will, he I got will, them. I got them into. It well, me and Sean, so we... why do you guys play this game so much? Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you really enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up button. And if you want to keep up with everything we're doing, hit the subscription button on the video. And if you want to see more Two Bit Podcast videos, hit the video on the right. Or, if you want to see some 2-bit reviews, hit that video on the left. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.